Hello, and I am the Reverend um, Dr. Carlton Turner, or just Carlton, and I'm a, a Caribbean contextual theologian working at the Queen's Foundation in Birmingham in the UK. And if you hear from this accent, I am not from the UK, I am a Bahamian. So I'm from the most beautiful place on earth, the Bahamas. And I grew up as an Anglican in the Bahamas. And from childhood, I always struggled with the tension between my church and my culture and indigenous African Caribbean ways of being to begin with. I mean, things like carnival or storytelling or even the way we speak, our patois. And fast forward a few years, I trained and became an Anglican priest. I never once was my indigenous heritage a fact in my training. I studied at the at Codrington College in Barbados, which was a former slave plantation. And if you know the history of that place, it was given to the then SPG as a place to develop local ministry and, and, and other forms of, of training for local gentry. But it was a slave plantation. And I eventually did my doctoral research in the, on the tensions between faith and culture and how so often churches, pra, churches, church practices perpetuate what I call self-negation. In other words, shame. I found myself researching shame on a macro level, on, a, on a, an institutional, a national, a cultural level. Shame, my friends, is no joke. And what I felt in childhood and culturally in the deepest parts of my life is something that is quite toxic and destructive to individuals, family systems, cultural systems, church and religious systems. And I want to know more about shame. And I invite you to this upcoming conference where we can learn more about how the idea and reality of shame forces us to see church differently, see God differently, and also to see ourselves differently. So I look forward to seeing you and engaging with you at the Gospel Redemption and Shame Conference on the 14th of October.